Hi beauties, welcome back. Today, we have another unboxing of the subscription box. This one showed up a little bit later this month than I was expecting it to. Normally they're like Johnny on the spot getting it to you right at the beginning of the month. And uh, it actually showed up the day before my boxy charm did. So it's, you know, it'd be like that sometimes. This is of course the Glow Attic beauty box. Uh, I did lock into a year a couple months ago. We've seen a couple boxes. Um, I've seen people kind of hate on this. They're very indie, very small. I think they're, I have the medium size box, not the skincare box. It's like the bigger beauty one. And then they have a small beauty one. Um, so this one is like $18.99 plus shipping a month. It winds up being like $22, I think. I've only had one box that I thought was kind of like meh, but even that box I really didn't think was that bad. So I'm excited to see what we are getting this month. Um, this is not a customized box. Everybody gets the same box each month. I do remember seeing stuff about it, but I honest to God cannot remember what it was that I saw. So, uh, oh, product down, product down. Hopefully it wasn't something breakable, my God. They, they always send different packaging. So like, sometimes it's a box, sometimes it's a bag. I never know what to expect. There's a lipstick. There's a lipstick that fell on the ground uh, from a peel. Cool packaging on it. Uh, kind of looks like a doorknob. <laughs> I don't know, kind of looks like a little doorknob. I'm gonna actually open this up because it looks like it's a really vibrant red, uh, which I, somebody like my mom, she's very into neutral, so this would not have been a great choice for her. But I personally really, really like having like a bright red, very noticeable lip color during the holiday season. I find that that's always a nice little staple item. I think a lot of people would agree with me too. I only mention my mom because, you know, I do my Ipsy versus Ipsy with her box. And so I always talk about her preferences and what she likes to get. And, all right, maybe I'm not gonna open this right now because this is like, I apparently need like some sort of physics degree to be able to break into this. Oh, there we go. I just, I just tore, I just drug my nail down it and found a weak point and then I tore into it like a bird of prey into its unknowing victim in the ground below. Pretty nice classic red. I think it's a good thing to have going into the holiday season. Um, not that I plan on attending any holiday parties this year, but still, when we're moving into the house, I will be wearing this very nice red lipstick. Pretty, uh, I like it and I definitely, I love cool packaging, especially with lipsticks. I think it's, uh, there's a lot of fun things you can do with that, so I like that. Um, and this is from, I think I said it, but it's a Peel Cosmetics Ultra Cream Lipstick in the shade Next Level, which, we all know. All right, next thing we have here is a sheet mask from Sweet Chef. It's a kale and vitamin B fresh pressed sheet mask. I've actually gotten this exact sheet mask before in an Ipsy. Um, they sent me like a bundle of three and the kale was one of the ones that I've gotten. I've used the sweet potato one, I think, but I haven't used the kale one yet. So um, I'm actually kind of jazzed about it. I always get masks and stuff. So I always kind of, I'm like, meh, but I do like sheet masks. And with 2020 being the way it has been, I've done a lot more skincare and a lot more sheet masks um, on a regular basis so yeah good product nice little addition to the bag right there oh sweet the next thing we got is a nice little four piece of beauty beauty by a bird is what it looks like the brand is um it is a nice little uh four piece eyeshadow brush set and uh if you guys know me you know i have recently discovered i love collecting eyeshadow brushes uh because the more i have the less i have to wash them so i just go through them it's like and then suddenly I have a pile of 150 brushes that need to be washed all at once because they're they're all gone. So is that a healthy coping mechanism or way to handle my life? It is not, but it is how I roll. So what are you gonna do? So yeah, uh, I like those, definitely nice little things to have. Um, I really feel like at this point brushes are never, I'm never gonna be upset with them. So, oh, this is a nice product I can tell. This here is the derma E. I think, or Derme, maybe it's Derme. It is a hydrating night cream with hyaluronic acid. It looks like it's a nice big size. Yeah, it's actually like a very nice, like it's very filled. Um, these jars are often misleading because there's so much extra packaging, but it's pretty deep down there. It's a pretty big size. It's, it's two ounces. Yeah, that's good. That's really good. Like that a lot. And I love pretty much anything with hyaluronic acid in it. So I'm into it. All right, final thing we have is Oh, wait, I'm sorry, I just read something. I don't know why they did this. Sorry, I was reading. I was reading and pondering. So I got a thing that says notice. We wanted to let you know that the coveted Derma E night cream did not fit in our regular Glow Attic beauty box. So we decided to bag the items in order to deliver a valuable assortment. That's okay. It's, we've gotten bags before, so I'm confused. Uh, to apologize for this inconvenience, we have created a 50% to 90% off early access shop just for you, subscribers only. Scan the QR code on the back and use the VIP code to get in. 
I feel like they're just saying that, like this is an apology present when they actually were gonna do that anyway. But I don't know. Cause it's like, it's, I don't know why they're apologizing for something that didn't bother me. Like the fact that it showed up in a bag doesn't bother me unless this palette is broken. That's how I feel about it. And my, you know my lock, my palette might be broken, but yeah, oh, we made it. Yes, boys, we made it. All right, so this is a super precious, perfect for fall little uh, eyeshadow palette. This is uh, the Sweetie Pie palette from Millennial Beauté, I think. Um, and it is hemp infused, which I have been a big fan of hemp products and CBD oils and stuff like that this year as well. So uh, definitely into it. And it's super, super cute. The list, it's got like a little list up at the top. This is bake sale with like the prices of the pies. You've got OG pumpkin pie, strawberry cushy pie, Bubba blueberry and pineapple express pie funny as shit. Love it. And then beautiful colors, beautiful, beautiful fall colors. Um, absolutely jazzed about trying this out. I think you can make a really gorgeous look with this box. Um, I think I'm going to on the channel. Uh, I felt the same way about my boxy charm. It was very fall oriented, very beautiful. They really worked out. The colors combinations really worked well together. I think that we can do a lot with a, just the two beauty boxes that I've received so far this month. So really jazzed about it. Great month. Um, I like it a lot. So yeah, if you like the video, Give it a thumbs up if you like us. Subscribe, we're fun and cool. We do lots of unboxings and uh, makeup stuff and other beauty related things. And sometimes I look up history stuff and I share those with you. So yeah, if you like us, definitely join the family. Sorry, I made that weird. I don't, I'm, I apologize. I definitely made that weird there. But anyway, uh, I hope you guys are all safe, healthy. You have a wonderful day and you stay girly with a dark twist.